okay. Okay. One, two, three, three, two, one. Oh, what happened? Why can I cannot see? Why can I cannot see myself? Oh, wait. Yeah, I have to see myself. Okay. Okay. Let me go. Oh, okay. All right. Hello. How are Hi. you doing? Hello. I'm good, thank you. Uh, my name is Misha. What is your name? My name is Nu. Nice to meet you, Nu. So today we will talk about English for Business. And the topic is WH clauses. All right. And let's get into it. Okay, so this is the words we will be talking about today, WH words. So the words are what, when, where, who, which, why, and how. Okay, let's say them together. You, you say after me, all right? So uh, what? What? When? When? Where? Where? Who? Ooh. Which? Which? Why? Why? And how? How? Okay, great. Okay, so I will give you some examples. I knew what was on his mind. That's the one. Uh, when will we start the lesson? So uh, again, this is about how do we use those words. Uh, I knew what was on his mind. So this word, uh, what, we normally say it when we didn't hear someone or maybe we want, to, we want him to repeat the phrase that he said, yeah? So I knew what was on his mind, what exactly was on his mind, yeah? Next one, when, when will we start the lesson, my friend? What time will we start the lesson, yeah? Okay, he wondered, where his friends were, where are his friends? Are they here, are they there? We don't know. Who ate all the pies? Yeah, which of those houses do you live in? So which, is it this house, that house? Why is the sky blue? Yeah, good question. How did you two meet each other? Okay, so this is uh, examples of uh, using those words. Let's get into the words. Let's talk about each word um more uh, more in detail all right so what uh again so what is this very common word we use it every day i think very often i think you heard it before you used it before i'm sure right what yeah <laughs> what yeah uh, okay okay sure uh another another one is uh when so uh when is about uh, like uh, what what time or when will you come to the meeting or when will this lesson end finally like this okay next one is where so oh. normally we ask for uh, directions this is where it's like is it is it grand canyon is it uh, hollywood last week i guess you see i got some pictures here for uh, these words. And next word is who, like who are you? Or who is your friend? Who is this person? We have this person, who is this person? Yeah, we, we try, we use this word when we want to know more, or maybe we want to know uh, something about that person. Yeah, like who are they? Which, so which is, uh, it can be used in relationship to a person or to a subject. Yeah, like which, which book do you like? Like this, or uh, which singer is your favorite? Like if you have a choice of singers, like there's one, two, three, four of them, and we ask which one, is it the first one or the second one? Which one is uh, the best, for example? Yeah, okay, next one is why. <laughs> I got this meme for the word why, like why, why does this happening? 
what are we doing here? Oh, again, why? Let's talk about why. So like, why? Why did you do this? Or um, like, why is it raining today? Kind of question we, we cannot answer, yeah? And uh, the last one, uh, the last word is uh, how. Like, how is this happening? Uh, or how did you do that? It means like, uh, how exactly, like, how did this happen? This kind of work. And you want to know the detail about a uh, process, about something, uh, some kind of details. Uh, okay, so uh, let's talk about uses. And here I want your uh, help. So we will be working together. You have to repeat after me each of these sentences, okay? So first use is in WH questions. And now you repeat after me. Uh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Not bad. Okay, who ate all the pies? Who ate all the pies? And uh, why did you do that? Why do you do that? Okay, okay, good. All right. Uh, another use is when we use verbs of uh, thinking. So thinking is uh, no, oh wait, sorry. Uh, no, understand, uh, suppose, remember, forget, or uh, wonder. Okay, so first, uh, and now, now you will repeat after me, okay? I know where you live. I know where you live. Okay, good, good one, good one. And next one, she could not remember who he was. He could not remember who he was. All right, one more time, one more time, okay? She could not remember who he was. He could not remember who he was. And one more. I wonder if we will see Peter. I wonder if we will see later. Peter. One more time. I wonder if we will see Peter. I wonder if we will see Peter. Okay, okay. Another way to use it in the sentence is after verbs of saying. So it's a verbs like ask, say, admit, argue, reply, agree, mention, explain, or suggest. All right. And okay, so now after me, I asked what she wanted. I asked what she wanted. One more time, I asked what she wanted. I asked what she wanted. Okay, make sure to include uh, asked. So uh, there is ask and there is asked. It's a small difference, but it's a different time. You see, a present is ask. Uh, and if you talk in the past time, it's asked. So make sure to include ed in your pronunciation, okay? Okay. All right, so one more time, okay? I asked what she wanted. I asked what she wanted. Okay, okay, good. Uh, one more, he tried to explain how the accident had happened. He tried to explain how the accident has happened. And uh, uh, one more. Uh, did he say when he would come? He, did he say when he would come? Okay. Can you think? Okay, I give you a small assignment. Can you give me example of question with when or oh, when? Can you when, make right? 
When? Can you make a sentence? When can I have lunch? Good. Good one. Great job. Okay. Another one. After some verbs of thinking and saying, we use WH words and the two infinitive. Let's look at the examples. We didn't know what to do. We didn't know what to do. Okay, uh, what to, so to infinitive, you see what to do. What to do. Okay. Yeah, uh, one more time. We didn't know what to do. We didn't know what to do. Okay, good. Can anyone suggest where to go for lunch? Can anyone suggest where to go for lunch? Good, good one. Okay, and after some nouns, to say more about the noun, this is another way we can use uh, WH clauses if we want to say more about what do we mean, like to add some more details in the sentence, to add some texture, to make it more uh, interesting, yeah? Is there any reason why I should stay? Is there any reason why I should stay? Okay, good one. Okay, that was the town where I grew up. Just for the town where I grew up. Okay, okay. Uh, one more time, please. That was the town where I grew up. That was the, that, that was the town where I grew up. Okay, and last one. That was the town where I grew up. One more time. That was the town where I grew up. Okay, okay, great. Can you, can you see everything well? Is it all right? Can, can you so see? Was the town, the town where, where I grew up. Okay, okay, great, great. All right, sure. Um, and one more, one more thing is we often use a WH clause after is, okay? So uh, for example, this is where I live. Again, this is where I live. And now it's your turn. This is where I live. Okay, good one, good one. Uh, one more, uh, that's what I thought, so is called, so is, it means that is, but normally when we speak, we say that's. We kind of skip yes. it, yeah? Right, that. that is is like too long, so we try to make it shorter in, uh, in a regular speech, right? Uh, informal speech, and that's what I thought. That's what I thought. One more time, try to, okay, let's make it slowly. Let's speak it, let's, let's just say it slowly. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Okay, okay, good one. All right, and last, I missed my bus. That's why I was late. I missed my bus that's why i was late okay okay good one okay so now let's practice so what we're gonna do is we will do like a short conversation it's short in terms of like really short uh you're gonna give me a question and i will answer and then we will switch the roles so first you ask me, I answer, okay? And then um, I ask you something and you answer to me, all right? Right. 
Okay, so I will give you an example. Let's say I will start. So um, I am you right now. So the question is, whom would you like to see? And I will answer to you. I would like to see Vichyan, like this. Understand? Yes, then. Okay, so you start. You start. You give me a question. And I will be the question, right? Yeah. Uh, whom would you like to see? I'd like to see Vichyan. Okay, and now let's switch. I will ask you and you read the answer. You answer me, okay? Yes. Okay, so whom would you like to see? I like to see Vishyan. Good one. Okay. All right. Uh, your turn. You start. Which room will he stay in Bangkok? Sorry. Say again. Which which room will he stay in Bangkok? Ah, okay. I hear you now. He will stay with his friend. Okay, now we switch the roles. All right, so I ask you, you answer to me. Uh, with whom will he stay in Bangkok? He will stay with his friend. Okay, good job, good one. All right, and again, you start, you start. You ask me the question. When will the show start and finish? Say again. When will the show start and finish? Ah, it will start at three and finish at six. Okay, we switch the roles. I ask you, uh, when will the show start and finish? It will start at three and finish at six. Okay, good one. Um, all right, you ask me. How is your English? It's very good. And my turn. How is your English? It's very good. All right. All right. Can you uh, can you give me some example of sentence with how? Can you make a sentence with how? How how old are you? How old are me? Okay. All right. That's great. Good one. Uh, what, can you can you do something with uh, who? Who are you who are study you? with? Who are you dating? Who, how, how, right? How? No, 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 who, who, yeah, that's right. Who? 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 Um, yeah. Who did you go with? Who did you go with? Yeah? Yes. Okay, all right, that's good. And, um, uh, what if it's not a question? Can you make uh, something? Okay, let's go. Uh, let's get back to. Uh, I will give you all the words. Okay, so again, uh, seven words, right? What, when, uh, where, who, which, why, and uh, how? Yeah. Um, so can you give me something with what, which is not a question? Okay, this is a challenge for you. Make a sentence with what, which is not a question. No vacation. What? You have an example here. You can you can kind of uh, use this as an example. So like try to make something similar. I, I know what was on his mind. Okay, yeah, that's, that's what we have here. All right, yeah, so this is, this is a bit challenging, but uh, I hope you understand. So again, what uh, is not only for questions, you can use it for statements as well. It's not, and uh, in fact, any of these words, uh, they can be used uh, both in questions and in statements. It's like, not only question, okay? There's many ways to use it. 
these words are uh, they are very flexible. They can be used anywhere you want to use them. So again, we have one more time. So uh, what? And we have uh, when. Like what time is it? We have where, and uh, we have who. We have which. Which one? Uh, we have why, right? And last time we have is how. Just how is this happening? And uh, okay, so I think that's it for today. Thank you for your attention. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye, teacher.